Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 edition. Page 205, Antibodies and their Associated Disorder. There's not much to explain here, it's just a list of different antibodies and the disorders they're associated with. But it is a high yield topic, so it's worth knowing. What disorder is antinuclear antibodies associated with? Antinuclear antibodies, or ANA, are associated with lupus. What disorder is anti-double-stranded DNA, or anti-Smith antibodies, associated with? Anti-double-stranded DNA, or anti-Smith antibodies, are also associated with lupus. What condition is antihistone antibodies associated with? Antihistone antibodies are associated with drug-induced lupus. What disorder is rheumatoid factor and anti-cyclic citrullinated peptide antibodies associated with? Rheumatoid factor and anti-CCP are associated with rheumatoid arthritis. What disorder is anti-centromere antibodies associated with? Anti-centromere antibodies are associated with scleroderma or Crest syndrome. What disorder is anti-SCL70 or anti-DNA topoisomerase 1 antibodies associated with? Anti-SCL70 or anti-DNA topoisomerase 1 antibodies is associated with diffuse scleroderma. What disorder is anti-mitochondrial antibodies associated with? Anti-mitochondrial antibodies associated with primary biliary cirrhosis. What disorder is IgA anti-endomycial and IgA anti-tissue glutaminase antibodies associated with? IgA anti-endomycial and IgA anti-tissue glutaminase are associated with celiac disease. What disorder is anti-basement membrane antibodies associated with? Anti-basement membrane antibodies are associated with good pasture syndrome. What disorder is anti-desmogline antibodies associated with? Anti-desmogline antibodies are associated with pemphigus vulgaris. What disorder is anti-microsomal and anti-thyroglobulin antibodies associated with? Anti-microsomal and anti-thyroglobulin antibodies are associated with Hashimoto's thyroiditis. What disorders are anti-JO1 and anti-SRP and anti-ME2 antibodies associated with? These antibodies are associated with polymyositis and dermatomyositis. What disorder is the anti-SSA or anti-RO antibodies associated with? Anti-SSA or anti-RO antibodies are associated with Sjogren's syndrome. What disorder is the anti-SSB or anti-LA antibodies associated with? Anti-SSB or anti-LA antibodies are also associated with Sjogren's syndrome. What disorder is the anti-U1 ribonucleoprotein antibody associated with? Anti-U1 ribonucleoprotein antibody is associated with mixed connective tissue disease. What disorder is the anti-smooth muscle autoantibody associated with? Anti-smooth muscle autoantibody is associated with autoimmune hepatitis. What disorder is the anti-glutamate decarboxylase antibody associated with? Anti-glutamate decarboxylase antibody is associated with type 1 diabetes mellitus. What disorder is the C-ANCA antibody associated with? The C-ANCA antibody is associated with granulomatosis with polyangitis, which is also known as Wegener's granulomatosis. What disorders is P. Inca autoantibody associated with? P. Inca autoantibody is associated with microscopic polyangitis and Churg Strauss syndrome. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.